Dwayne here, phoenixtypewriter.com. Got a Smith Corona silent super here on the bench. This is the one I had so much trouble with. Everything was messed up. Pieces missing, screws missing, type bars bent, links off, all kinds of good stuff. Including this screw right here was missing. That screw is part of this whole black bar that runs underneath this silver bar to that screw and it holds all the springs in place down here for the keyboard right there but when I went to replace the screw over here I figured it'd just be a standard screw but if you look at this screw it's long that screw is really long and so then I'm thinking well if that screws long maybe it was long on purpose so you could back it out and then lower that black portion where the springs are connected and lighten the keyboard touch. So I found another long screw over here and I put it in and while I was looking at this I found another screw right here in the middle right there that's also tight. So if you were to loosen the screw in the middle first right here like that and then back this screw out um, a certain amount let's just go let's just back it out right about about halfway down the threads and then this one also back it out about halfway down the threads like that like right about there and then tighten up the one in the center like that right there that in theory should put less spring tension on these key levers and I think it does because I tried it it makes it makes these a little bit easier to push of course there's a can't go too far, you've got to have a spring to bring the type bar back, but I flushed this thing out, I mean, it, it is as good as it gets as far as action goes, so it's having no trouble rebounding those type bars. I think I have found the keyboard adjustment tension on these Smith Coronas that I never knew about. The actual touch control is right here. It really doesn't do much. When it's on light, it, it doesn't affect the spring. There's a spring down in here. It doesn't even activate the spring until you get about halfway on this and then all the way. It's a very light spring. Barely notice any difference between light and heavy. Really can't tell. But you can tell when I lowered this a little bit, you can actually feel a difference in these the action to the keyboard. So I only went halfway. I could go probably go a little further if we wanted. So now there's a gap here between that black plate and the silver plate, which there wasn't before. So and that is directly connected to the springs that are directly connected to the keyboard levers. Uh, pretty neat. Um, I'm gonna think that's a Nice little trick I've learned after 40 years of working on these. Alright, Phoenix Typewriter, good day.